In this video, I will compare Typeform versus SurveyMonkey and tell you which of these two platforms is best for you and your needs. So if you want to build a survey, then SurveyMonkey could be the best fit for you. So first let's cover what exactly they do and who they are for. So as you can see, SurveyMonkey helps you create surveys and forms online within minutes and they help you do this using their AI, although you can also do it without the AI. But the AI is a feature that you will also find in Typeform. Now with Typeform you can do very similar things. They also have a form builder and a survey maker, so the same as SurveyMonkey. And then on top of that, they have a quiz maker. So right away, if you want to create a quiz, and maybe you also want to make forms and surveys, but if one of the things you want to make is quizzes, then probably go with Typeform, since on SurveyMonkey this is not included. Now if you're looking for the two with the best now, if you're interested in the tool with the best templates for forms and surveys, then in my opinion, that is SurveyMonkey. You can see on their website for templates, they have a bunch of things right here, but you can simply click see all templates in the bottom left. And here you will see all these templates that they have. For example, for forms, they have an application forms. And then right here, they also have a bunch of different templates. For example, a car rental application form, property rental, private school. So you can just search for what you are looking for and maybe they will have something. They have hundreds of different templates. Now, if they don't have the template, then that's also fine. But then SurveyMonkey is not necessarily better. But what I recommend you to do is to go to surveymonkey.com, then click templates here and then click see all templates and see if they have a template that is for what you want to create forms or surveys for. Now, if they don't, then I recommend you to look at their pricing since they both allow you to create pretty basic forms and surveys very easily using AI. So SurveyMonkey's pricing is for teams, individuals or enterprise. Now it's all in Dutch right here, but I cannot change it. But for example, for individuals, you have the standard plan at 39 euros per month. And here you get 1000 responses every month. Then you have the advantage yearly, which is 36 euros per month and the premier yearly, which is 99 euros per month. Then you also have plans for teams and enterprises. Now comparing this to Typeform's pricing, so for SurveyMonkey, the cheapest plan is 39 euros per month for individuals. Then on Typeform, it's less with only 25 euros and Typeform has a completely free plan that you can just get started with in the link in the description if you're interested in that. So in the free plan, you will get 10 responses per month, but it's also just a great way to start building your form since you can already do that. Now, if you want to upgrade here, you will get 100 responses per month. Then here for 55 euros, you get 1,003 users. You will also get to remove the type from branding and connect a custom domain. And then in the business plan, you get 10,000 responses every single month. Now, to give you a conclusion of Typeform versus SurveyMonkey, I would personally go with Typeform in most cases since they have a free plan available. And again, if you want to get started with the free plan, click on the link in the description and here click get started, it's free. And by doing that, you will automatically join into their free plan and you don't even need to add any payment details or anything like that. Now, the only reason I would personally go with SurveyMonkey is if you want to use their templates and they already have templates that match with what you want to do. For example, if they have an exact application form that you wanted to build, then it's faster to just get the template on SurveyMonkey. However, if the price is also an important factor, then you could still go with Typeform because Typeform also has some templates, but they just have less. So that concludes this comparison of Typeform versus SurveyMonkey. Again, if you want to get started with Typeform, make sure to click on the link down in the description to get started completely for free. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.